Hello everybody, my name is Gary Potter, welcome back to another video, so today in this video we are back, and today we are here playing Two Point Hospital. I saw everybody else playing this game, and I was like, dang it, I don't have it, but now I do, so let's play! At Two Point Hospital, over 52% of our patients Ew, believe they leave gross. healthier than when they arrived. Our precisely calibrated equipment is operated by compassionate healthcare mm. practitioners, many of whom have even been to medical school or watched ER. If you right. suffer from turtle head, let us ease your worries and noggin gently out of your body. Mmm. Just infection is no laughing matter. Put your trust and oversized shoes in our capable hands. We're building a brighter, safer future, and hardly anything will stand in our way. You deserve the best. So join us at Two Point Hospital. We're open for new staff, new patients, and a new you. Can I go play golf yet? I'm teeing off at three. <laughs> wow, that was an intro. That was. That's how I'm starting out all of my videos from now on. Wow. Welcome to Two Point County. I'm Albert Crank. I'll be your trusty advisor on this journey. This is Hogspore, and here's your first hospital. Click on it to get started. Okay, great. I'm clicking. I'm clicking on it. Okay, there we go. Uh, begin your career as a hospital administrator. Learn the basics of the job by establishing your first hospital. Uh, okay. Welcome to Two Point County. Are you ready to start building your first hospital and curing some patients? No. I think I get that part. Uh, moving the camera, blah, blah, blah. Yes, I know every tycoon game ever. The first thing the hospital will need is a reception. Patients will head here when they arrive at the hospital. Let's build a reception desk near the entrance. The sensitivity is kind of really high. How? No. I want to put the reception desk right there. We're going to be abstract. Great. We'll need an assistant to run a reception. Let's hire one now. Blah, 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 blah. Assistant. Who's good? Ernie. Click, uh, select a job, then click hire button. We have a bunch of money, so... Her. Short temper. Oh. Hygiene thinks their life is a rom-com, puts out of order signs on things that aren't. <laughs> I like her. Nasty has potential, gets stuck in trees. Inspiring wants more money comes with kung fu grip. Okay, you're being hired today. Yeah, yeah, you have kung fu, so, you know. Practitioner's office. Great, before we officially open, we'll need a GP's office. But patients will visit a doctor working as a general pra practitioner at each stage of diagnosis. The GP will assess patients and decide if they are ready for treatment or if they require further diagnostics. To build a room, click on the room button and da, 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 da. let's build it right here. Right off the edge. We'll have the door right here. The desk right there. This is a really big room. It's fine. That was cute. Excellent, now we'll need a doctor to run the GP's office. Doctors. Class clown wanders off on trips. Likes to argue the girl next door understands digital memory to an extent. Has magic healing hands. Charming. Has potential to develop an effective mid-range game. Okay. We'll hire you. Please pretend there's a fire. Hospital open. Good news, our hospital is now open for business. Patients are starting to arrive after they register at reception. They'll be sent to the GP for diagnosis. Uh, to zoom in and out, use the mouse wheel to rotate and view. Hold the middle mouse button and move to the to pitch the view. Hold the middle mouse button and move the mouse up and down. Oh, I see. Okay. Can we destroy this room? Edit. No, I want to shrink it. So it's fine where it is, but I can I, like, shrink it? Subtract Welcome back to your around. favorite radio station with the vastly overqualified Sir Nigel Bickleworth. 
I am here to this inform, is a three by three, to entertain, so. and to bring some small measure of sophistication to your drab little lives. Should any of you have any requests for popular tunes, as I believe people like to call them, do not hesitate to repress that impulse. I have no intention of playing any of that drivel. I like him. Okay, that's a three by three. So now what are we doing, actually? Oh, wait. Okay, hang on, 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 hang on. How do you... Okay. Rotate item. Okay, so Z. Got it. Whoa, he just jumped. Okay. That's cute. I should have known that before I did this. Or I should have figured that out. That the desk was facing the wrong way. I didn't. Okay, there. Now you can go in the room. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You can go now. Mmm. Mm, yes. I see, I understand. Diagnosed happiness. Okay, got it. Great. We've diagnosed our first patient. The GPS sent a message. Have a look at the message list in the bottom right. A uh, pharmacy required. Our doctors have discovered a new illness. Grout. Grout is frequently transmitted in bathrooms and modern medication is effective. Unlike earlier times when it had to be dug out painfully with a screwdriver. Oh my lord. The patient is seeking treatment. We will need a pharmacy in order to treat them. Uh, what would you like to do? Get patient to wait. And I'm gonna build them a pharmacy. We'll build the pharmacy in this corner. How big does the pharmacy have to be? What do you what all do you need in a pharmacy? We'll have it be that big. Could patients please stop coughing? This? Could patients please stop coughing? Stop coughing. Wow. That's not even centered. Right there. Uh build a pharmacy and hire a nurse. What do you need in the pharmacy, though? It doesn't really tell me. Is that good? Is that all you need in the pharmacy? And hire a nurse. Uh, Molly. Positive, weak bladder, needs peace and quiet. Inspiring, the boy next door loves peeled food. And motivated, positive, will work for peanuts. Opinionated about pencil hardness. I like her. Okay, now it's ready. So that's what you need. Okay, got it. Okay, all of my patients, go. Well done, you've cur we've cured our first patient. We've earned some money and the hospital's reputation has improved, which will attract more patients. When a doctor or nurse treats a patient, their ability will, inf with the will influence the chance of success. Some illnesses are tougher than others. Continue diagnosis and treating patients to keep the money coming in so we can expand the hospital. By curing patients, we improve the hospital reputation. This will attract more patients, allowing us to bring in more money. Yeah, money. So all rooms need to be a three by three or bigger. Janitors and maintenance. Now that we got some expensive machinery, we should think about looking after it. Machines will deteriorate with use and will need repairing from time to time. If a machine falls into disrepair, disrepair it can be a fire hazard. Fires are generally considered um, bad for business. Hire a janitor to maintain machines while you're at it. Make sure you've got some fire extinguishers nearby. Better safe than sorry, right? Okay, so hire a janitor. Inspiring has lost count. Nasty needs peace and quiet. Hygienic gets stuck in trees. You're perfect! Keeping people happy. It's important to keep your staff and patients happy to ensure the hospital runs smooth. Is he talking about eggs? Uh, it's important to keep your staff and patients happy to ensure the hospital runs smoothly. Patients will get bored, thirsty, and hungry over time. Make sure that they have access to entertainment, food, drinks, and a comfy seat. When they're between appointments, if they become unhappy, they will leave to go to another hospital. Shooty, shooty, shoot. Okay, um... Our doctors have discovered a new illness. Clamp. Once this grips a patient, it doesn't let go. Afflicts many living status... Statues and selfie-taking chumps. We'll send the patient for treatment in our pharmacy. <laughs> uh... Hospital reputation increases. Yeah, I already got that. Rotate an item when holding... Yeah, I already got that one too. Actually, I didn't get that one, but it would have been nice to have it later. Or earlier. Okay. 
we will have a bench right here. We'll have another one right here. And another one right there. Everybody get the top. And then we'll have drink machines. We'll have a burp right there. And we'll have a cheesy goblin gubbins right there. For medical reasons. Staff and energy break. Staff get tired as they work and will eventually go on break. A break. A staff room will help them relax and return to work energized. Drink. Drinks and snacks help them happy to help them stay happy too. Uh, if you make a room larger and fill it with interesting items, it will be considered more prestigious. People using a high prestige room will become happier. A nice staff room will also help staff regain energy faster. We'll build the staff room in this corner. What all do you need in a staff room? Uh, staff will head to a staff room when they're on break. Fill the room with interesting items to help them become fully refreshed before their break ends. You can place a member of staff in the staff room to make them take a break or in a work room to make them work there. To pick up a member of staff, ho hover over them and hold the left and mouse button. Okay, wait, so can we add more items to here? Drinks and snacks are great for people who need to have them, but they can lead to littering if there are no bins nearby. While we're at it, staff and patients will get really grumpy if they don't have access to any toilets. You might want to invest in some quality pro- <laughs> We need so much! I'm gonna put drinks and snacks in here. That looks cramped, but that's okay. And then we'll put a bin right next to the door. And now we need more... A toilet? Toilet sets. sets. How big do the toilets need to be? It would be really nice if I got told these things. We'll make it that big. We'll put the door on that side. There are windows... Right here. Perfect! Finish the room! Uh, we'll empty bins and unlock toilets when required. This is much better than having to sweep up litter and erm... Um, other waste. Ew? We're hearing reports of some illnesses in town. These might be harder to diagnose. We need to build a new diagnosis room. If a GP isn't certain, they will send a patient for further diagnosis. General diagnosis. Where can this room go? We'll put this, as you expand the hospital with more rooms and staff, the hospital lever increases, the larger hospital attracts more patients, as the hospital gets busier, queues may start to get long, we need to build more GP's office in other rooms and hire more staff to deal with the extra patients, look out for queue warnings above rooms, you can also hover over a room to highlight people queuing for that room. Okay, so I'm gonna build another GP's office right here, this is where the GP's office is gonna be, or wait, no, this isn't a GP's office, this is another diagnose room. Oh, do I need to hire somebody for this room? I don't know. Is he sleeping? That's a moustache if I've ever seen one. Staff, or, er, oh, there's a peculiar new illness in town, lightheadedness. We're going to need some expensive, expensive new equipment to deal with this. Continue to expand your hospital. Uh, staff, we need a new nurse. You! Hygienic will work for peanuts doesn't speak Spanish. Is that an issue? High energy gets toilet rage positive vomits on impact. Hygienic has potential short temper doesn't trust fishmonger. Is that done? Oh, we need another GP's office. Uh, finish. Uh, wards can be used for diagnosis. And also to treat a range of illnesses. The nurse is required to admit each patient, look after them, and discharge them when they're ready to leave. Add multiple beds to a ward to deal with more than one patient at a time. You can also adjust the number of nurses that should work in the room settings. This is useful if you have lots of patients. More nurses. Uh, you, because you're the only person. New illness, bogworts discovered. Our doctors have discovered a new illness, bogworts, a rather disgusting skin condition caused by filthy toilets. It can be cured with an expensive cocktail of drugs, carefully prepared in the pharmacy or with a or with witchcraft. We'll send the patient for treatment in our pharmacy. And finish. Now we need to hire another assistant. No, 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 doctor, right? What are you? 
you are junior doctor, yeah. So, what do you have? Hangry, embarrassed by who they are. Oh, that's sad. High energy, can't drive. High energy, doesn't trust fish spawners. We'll do this one. Well done, the hospital ever has increased. Keep expanding your staff, more patients, and staff. Oh, attract, not extract. Haha, <laughs> silly me. Deluxe clinic unlocked. The Two Point Health Ministry is keen to recognize the achievements of every hospital in the county. If we can build a hospital that satisfies the needs of the local area, the hospital will be awarded on an official star rating. This will be great for our organization. Not only does each star come with associated rewards, but it will also allow us to establish new hospitals around the county. Continue to expand the hospital to acquire a one star rating. By completing objectives and challenges, our organization awards kudosh. You can use this uh, to unlock items to use in any of our hospitals. Check the item list to see what we can afford. New illness, Beth face discovered. A quite alarming contortion of the face caused by sleeping at a strange angle. Doctors recommend always using a bed protractor to monitor your sleeping angles. We'll send the patient for treatment in our ward. Uh, our doctors have discovered a new illness, misery guts, chronic grumpiness, grumpiness due to a nihilistic semicolon. We'll send the patient for treatment in our pharmacy. Uh, our doctors have diagnosed the patients with a but it requires a deluxe clinic for treatment. You should consider building one. Oh. A deluxe clinic. How, where am I going to build that? Right here, I guess. Whoa. You're getting the whole shebang, buddy. That's amazing. Wait, so can I just get people to keep switching between rooms? Do I not need it to be a specific? Oh my lord. Whoa, that suits you. You are good now, Naz. Chance of success was dying. Treatment failed. Sally! She died. Was that our first death? So does this just not work because you're not a doctor? Are you a doctor? Oh, you are a doctor. Okay, that one works. So sometimes you just don't get the best. Has anybody used the bathroom? Do you need anybody for the bathroom? Uh... No, people should know, you know, here, where it's always toilet time, and one in hospital. I want to see somebody go and, oh, he's heartbroken. Why is he heartbroken? The treatment failed. Nobody uses the toilette. And also, the toilette doesn't have a door. Awards and yearly review. Okay, hang on, I'll do that in a second. Two Point County Healthcare Award Ceremony. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm so excited! Oh, wow, I'm so honored. Okay, open. What are we gonna get? Oh my gosh. We got Doctor of the Year. Oh my gosh, I'm so flattered. Oh. oh my gosh, there's a more. Oh. What's this one? Oh my gosh, Nurse of the Year. Where? Oh, okay. My heart. <laughs> Guys, stop. Stop my heart. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <sighs> wow. What's this one? Oh. I didn't get an award for that one. What's this one? The Orb Foundation. How many more am I gonna get? Oh, I could just open them all. Patients should enjoy their visit. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, where's the doctor? Your booty is out. That's inappropriate. I swear I had more doctors than this. What are you? A student nurse. You're also a nurse. Okay, she went to go help. Did you know patients in staff will want access to toilets, especially after eating or drinking? Ensure we have enough toilets to avoid accidents. We do. Nobody's used it. Private. Dear hospital administrator, one-star hospital. Congratulations, your hospital has been awarded a one-star rating. That's one 
out of a possible three by the Two Point Health Ministry. I have retrieved your file from my bin to celebrate. Continue to develop your enterprise and hog spore for further esteem and trinkets. If you believe that you're capable of more, alternately run before you can. Walk and begin to expand your organization by opening a new hospital in Lower Bullocks. The choice, as they say, is yours. Your fragrantly Tarquin Foxbridge Health Minister. We're not going to do that yet. I really, really want to figure out why the bathroom isn't working. Why nobody uses it. Many of human humanity's greatest ideas and endeavors were dreamt up during a visit to the la lavatory. In a recent survey, the toilets also topped the list of the country's favorite places to take a dump. Make sure to keep your toilets clean, otherwise hygiene levels can drop and spread germs to the rest of the hospital. On that topic, don't forget to install sinks and hand dryers. I have all of that. Staff promotion. Isabel Muck is ready for promotion from junior doctor to doctor. Promotion from junior doctor to doctor will provide plus one training slot, 10 movement speed, 10 diagnosis skill, 10 treatment skill. Offer a pay raise to keep staff happy. New salary, current salary. The bare minimum. There. Promote. Uh, one training point, ten marketing skill. What are you? For junior assistant. Our first, sad news, our first patient death. Patients can die if a treatment fails or if they are waiting too long and their health deteriorates. The hospital's reputation will suffer as a result. There's also a chance the patient will return to haunt the hospital. If this happens, we'll need a janitor with a ghost capture qualification. Wow, that's the tea. Ward emergency. A group of ward patients have fled from an orb wellness center and are now looking for further treatment. We'll be rewarded if we treat this group of patients. Should we have them sent here? Cure five patients with bed face, treatment room ward one in the hospital. Time limit 90 days. Rewards 10,000. Yes. Uh, oh dear, a patient appears to have returned from the dead. We'll need a janitor with a ghost capture qualification. No, let him live. Let him stay. Ooh, somebody's using the toilette. Okay, finally, but it was a doctor. Do the patients not use them? Whoa. Okay, give me a minute. We actually need to make another ward. So you, terribly dull, get stuck on boss fight. Litterer, sarcastically framed, trivial things. Thinks their life is a rom-com, nasty, litterer, suspicious of things. You're the only one that seems to be good enough. And I'm actually gonna edit this room. I'm sorry, patience. Just, like, give me a minute and I will have everything fixed. Alright, and now the wards are fixed. Yay, people are using the bathroom. Is this only a staff bathroom? Okay. Special report. Well done. We cured enough of the patient's group. This was helped our reputation and we've set up a reward. Four out of five of the patients. When a patient dies... Oh, I, did, I should have read that. A part of them stays, is what that said. A uh, health inspector arriving in nine days. Uh-oh. Oh, here he is. Okay, uh, lightheadedness emergency. There's been an outbreak of lightheadedness in the area, and once they've managed to communicate with a series of blink and flashes, it was clear that a group of them would be tr would like treatment. We'll be rewarded if we treat them, yes. Patients with lightheadedness are arriving. Okay, just open them all, because I don't have time for this. Nurse of the year, employer of the year, and doctor of the year, yeah. Uh, new illness, head crabbedness. Uh, the sufferer's head has seized by a rare form of parasitic crustacean. Fortunately, a treatment is available that wrenches the creature from the victim, leaving their head healthy and uninfested. We'll send the patient for treatment in our deluxe clinic. Do we have one of those? What? Oh, he's leaving. Are you gonna give me a letter or something? Tell me that I did a good job. Or did I usually do that after? Inspection report! Mr. Jobsworth has sent us the report from his recent visit. It's 30 pages, so we haven't read it, but the conclusion reads, Incredibly mediocre, with no features that sway the overall product. 
neither negatively nor positively outside of the realm of the ordinary. Nothing to complain about here, but not much to be happy about either. Well, I think our hospital's gorgeous. <gasps> Somebody died! No! Freeman failed for lightheadedness. Lester. I need you to come deal with this. Oh, it left. Oh, no, it didn't. He needs backed up. I like him. I think he should be allowed to stay. Oh, the plants need wa Okay, we're just gonna hire another janitor. Uh, what are you? Okay. Thinks their life is a rom-con, unhygienic, tends to notice fireworks. Funny, high-energy, motivated, fond of wooden floors. Unmotivated, once battled on an orchid. Wow. Motivated will help you move at the weekend. I'm gonna choose her, because she has... A lot going on for her. All of the plants. I did not know that plants needed watered. If I would have known that, I wouldn't have added them. They spelled customization wrong, didn't they? Isn't it spelled uh, C U S T O M I Z A T I O N? I think so. Customization. Maybe not. I don't know. Maybe I'm being extra dumb. But I'm also not thinking right now, so don't make fun of me. And if you do, then... Okay, great. Oh, you went to the bathroom. Does that count as break? Oh, it did! The Ooh. Have their life Lightheadedness emergency, course, more people. Okay, yeah. Um, Mr. Jobsworth has sent us the report from his recent visit. 30 pages. Incredibly mediocre ordinary. We already got that one. Okay. We're gonna build another thingy. Why is it only patients or people that work here patients that go to the bathroom? To okay, I have an idea. We're gonna close this, and we're gonna close this until we need it. So, whenever we get another person or more uh, people that need to have more head changing things. Lightheadedness. Whenever we get people to have lightheadedness, then we will open those again. Oh. Uh, lightheadedness emergency. Yes! Lightheadedness are arriving. This is what we needed. Special report. Well done. We cured enough of the patient's group. This has helped our reputation and we've been sent a reward. Six out of seven. That's what I'm talking about. Health inspection. Henry Jobsworth, the county's foremost health and inspector, has informed us that he'll be visiting us for inspection. Impressed with a nice hospital. 5,000? That's not that much. The patient has expired. Has expired. Whoa, that is brutal. Oh my gosh, he saw the ghost. I've been hot. Ooh, we got Patient's Choice Award. <gasps> Whoa. Staff promotion, yes. Okay. Uh, special report, six out of seven were cured. Oh, okay, this one's different. One of our county's better medical destinations is destined, destined to be a favorite of the sickly enthusiast in the known. Well done. An encouraging report from our influential figure in county's healthcare. Yes! There we go, that took too long. Congratulations, your hospital has been awarded a two-star rating by the Two Point Health Ministry. If you proceed at your current pace, you will have achieved everything that you can in your founding establishment soon enough. I can send your confidence inflating, careful that you don't build yourself up for an even greater fall. Yours fragrantly, blah, 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 blah. Cure 30 patients? It would have been nice to have done that before. I think we can actually do this, so I'm just gonna speed it up, and we're just gonna finish, we're gonna do this, and then we're gonna get a three-star rating, and then we're gonna end the episode, because I think the three-star is as high as you can go. Announcement. Oh, nothing. <laughs> Announcement. Ah, oh, nothing. We only have one left. Please cure them. No! Six out of seven. 
you cure a bunch of patients really fast, but you'll it will start slowing down. Like there, a little while ago, maybe like 30 seconds ago, we got three patients cured, and I think each, each time it's five or 8,000 or something. Plus, we get money from the vending machines, money from being diagnosed. You get money for a lot of things. So, you earn it fast, but yeah. So, bad face. Okay, so we need ward. Private, dear hospital administrator, three-star hospital. Congratulations, you have been rewarded. What? Your hospital has been rewarded a three-star rating by the Two Point Health Ministry. I hope for your sake that you remember how you were able to concoct such a model institution. Because the county will expect you to repeat this feat ad infumatum. May this free you of gumption and fill you with nerves. You're fragrantly... Perfect. So now we don't have anything. We don't need to do it. That means I get to end this episode. Woo! That makes me sound really selfish and mean. This video has been going on for an hour and almost 31 minutes. So, or more actually, because I didn't uh, press my timer thingy for a long time. So, anyways, that is the end of this episode. As I did say, I have been having a ton of fun. This is honestly maybe one of my favorite games. Um, went on to say, impress the VIP with a nice hospital. Anyways, this is one of my favorite games right now just because not only is it so cute, it runs fluently. It's just a ton of fun to play. Uh, there are still some things that I'm trying to figure out. I'm kind of confused why it's only uh, administration or staff that's using the bathroom and not patients. But, I mean, we can figure that out later. In the next episode, we're going to be moving on to the next hospital. Po possible? The next hospital. If you guys enjoy, please tell me down in the comments. Like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on my social medias. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye, guys.